Hi guys, I am Rina M. Twaim, and in this video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a jewelry stand. I have been a craft maker my whole life. Now I do greeting cards and I've had a huge success with them, but I've decided to add something else to my design collection and I've decided to add necklaces. Now it is a slow process for me because I'm totally new to the jewelry world, but I've started buying different things and now I have bought this during the COVID-19 time. So it took a minute for Rick to, to get here and then I have some other pieces that are coming later and now this is here, so why not? To do the unboxing all right first the craft makers will appreciate i'm just going to share with you that i'm using this scotch scissors absolutely love it i think i got it in hobby lobby love it so i just opened the box now this one is by Ada rocks and if i am not mistaken i have a stand like a plastic stand from them for my photography but i bought it a long time ago but i think they do a lot more than jewelry stands and so let me know if i'm right and i am excited to see this one. Oh my gosh it's so professional now i will let you uh know why i bought it i bought it because I want to do pictures and I want to do professional pictures and this uh, stand will let me do professional pictures. Now, I bought black because I do want to show the contrast. Like for example, if I use a white or any type of color beads, I want to be able to see the contrast though. Let's see how it looks like. Ooh, all right, all right, all right. Now, this is how it looks like. I absolutely hate that they used in packaging this thing on top of it. Like, that was not very smart because you can actually see, well, I think it goes away. Maybe if I can brush it, but there is an imprint, just a tiny little imprint of this on this velvet. So that's a packaging flaw. But because I have a, like a process of taking pictures on anything, I usually change up some color and we all do like make it brighter, make it more contrasty. So I think if there's any problem with this imprint, I will be able to um, do like uh, a contrast and I think it will be just fine, you know, and um, you can see the imprint if you look very close, but from the back, ooh, oh, you guys, I don't know about that. I definitely need to think about if I need to exchange this. Um, if not that, it's perfect, okay? If you're not as picky as me, you will absolutely love it. It does look like a natural neck, which is so beautiful. I love the material and I love how lightweight it is. I have been thinking to go to farmer's markets as well, so I will be taking this. Um, you guys, I have been rubbing a lot, and as I'm rubbing, I think the imprint is coming off, so because I was like, oh my gosh, do I need to go through the return process? It was not that expensive. So I don't think it's worth my time to like exchange it because I know that I will color grade the pictures a little bit once I put jewelry on it. So because of that, the black will be able to be more smooth on pictures than it is in real life. So for my purpose, it's perfect. I love the lightweight. I love the feel of this Velcro. You just you just want to keep touching really beautiful very professional i'm just beyond excited actually uh to use it in my new venture of jewelry i know nothing about jewelry i don't really wear my jewelry but i think once i start making it i'm gonna start wearing so thank you so much for watching i hope it was helpful to you now don't pay attention at me being super picky about the quality of this velvet look i don't know if you can see here we go judge it do you see a little bit but you can judge for yourself. You can judge for yourself if you love it, you know. And uh, I don't know how it looks like on video, but in real life, it's really dark, rich black. So it is very beautiful. I am going to leave a link below where I got it on Amazon. And I hope it was helpful to you. Let me know how you do packaging. Let me know what do you use uh, for showing off your jewelry or taking pictures. I want to know because there's so many different kinds of stands out there. I was Googling, I was like, oh my gosh, you know what uh, sold me on this? The price, yeah. So um, I am super excited to start using it. And uh, 
kind of dipping in into a jewelry world. Thank you so much for watching. I hope in some way it was helpful to you and let me know how your jewelry making going. Thank you so much. Bye guys. Good luck.